I'm going to show, because I want you to see this. I'm not sure if you saw this earlier. I'm going to show you how dangerous wearing a mask is. I have a carbon dioxide meter here, Gavin, and I have okay. an N95 mask. I'm going to put this on right now, put on my clown mask. Now, this, you put it in your home. You know, families probably that have kids are familiar with this. You put it in your home, it detects yep, dangerous levels. One. Yeah, Gavin has one. So this is one from your house. So I'm going to put this on. I'm going to put the sensor in my mask and, and, and watch what happens here, Gavin. Do a little play-by-play -play for me even because you're great at that. Okay. So he's got the mask on. He's putting it over his face. He looks much more attractive now that he's done that. Uh, most of his bad features have been hidden. We can just see his gorgeous eyes. Uh, he's got the meter in there. And uh, he's breathing in and out. We're going to see how much carbon dioxide... All right, here it's we dioxide, go. Dioxide, right? Yeah, carbon yep. dioxide. It's sitting on my cheek. It usually hits about, uh, usually takes about 10 seconds to catch up. And this is the N95 mask, by the way. This is the one that the they super say. Super mask. Yeah, this is the one that you're supposed to be wearing. I guess if I did this, maybe it would be a little better there. There we go. Now it's a little more tight. All right, so give it a couple seconds here. But if this alarm goes off, Gavin, that means I'm inhaling dangerous levels of carbon dioxide. Oh, there it goes. There it goes, Gavin. Look at that. That's amazing, dude. That, See that is amazing. Now, if this if this alarm was going off in your house, would you get your kids out of there? Yeah, we'd have a major problem. I believe my system goes right to the fire department and they come by immediately. <laughs> yeah. So look at the levels. Don't have to push a button. Look at the levels. They're shooting up close to five thousand. They're now over five thousand, Gavin. Look at that. We're you now know, we're now going over six thousand here, and I don't even have it in front of my mouth. It's on my cheek. So this is just the, this is just the air in my mask. Guys, go back to the meter. Look at that, Gavin. Over 6,000 now. And so now, I mean, folks, it, you can go look at this for yourself. If it reaches certain levels, you can have uh, long-lasting effects, folks. So, so there you go, Gavin. So this is what they want us to do, Gavin. They want us to breathe in deadly air that if you had this air in your home, you would call poison control, call the fire department, and evacuate your family. This is what they want us to do, Gavin. What do you think about that? I don't want to get too biblical on your ass, but this sounds satanic. It's Luciferian. How did God design us? He designed us to take in oxygen and breathe out CO2. Then he designed trees to reverse the process, and we all work together equally. When we put masks on, we inhibit the system that he created, and the next thing you know, we're suffocating ourselves. This is like with people with the exhaust in their car in the garage trying to commit suicide. That, that We have checks and balances in nature, and God is telling us to stop what we're doing because we're killing ourselves. You know what? I'm so glad you made that because that's exactly what this is. This is like sitting in your garage with the car on trying to commit suicide. Folks, I'm now, I, I just went over 10,000, Gavin. We just maxed out the meter. We just went over 10,000. We maxed out the meter. It would be so good.